Hey everyone, welcome back to Minecraft School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Uh, last time we got to Hogwarts, we got our first quest to go to the Charms Classroom. Took us ages to find it, but we are here now, so it's time for our first lesson. And... Oh, more quests down there. Oh, Charms is in here, okay. But there's a chest. Um, yeah, we're gonna be able to get our first quest. Uh, our first spell. Coins, wizard card, excellent. And dung bombs, great. Let's have a look. Charms classroom, right? Yes? Charms classroom, we did it! Oh, Flitwick! Hmm. Welcome students, my name is Professor Flitwick and I teach charms here at Hogwarts. It's Warwick Davis, hmm. you know. For this first class we'll be learning a simple spell, hmm. Lumos, which will allow you to cast light from the tip of your wand to illuminate dark places. Hmm. When you're in a room that's too dark for you to see anything, I'm not there. Very sad. Hmm. You can cast the Lumos spell by double clicking, right click. Hmm. Hmm. To practice Lumos, I've arranged a special task for you that you must complete. This hmm. is gonna be like the original, the original games. The task is simple. Hmm. Collect the five stars scattered throughout this maze of corridors and return to me to complete the lesson. That's great that they give you a little mini game hmm. sort of thing. Only this maze is completely dark, you'll need to use your wand to find your way. This is just like the, the original like PS1, PC hmm. games. Best of luck! Oh god, it's quite a maze. Well, this is exciting, isn't it? Equip our wand. Um. Oh. Oh! Oh, I wasn't done. How do I... Well, they're all locked. Lumos. It's already bright enough for you to see. Oh, okay, sorry. Oh. Oh, that's where I am. Okay. Uh, so if we... I've already forgotten. I mean, mazes are easy, right? You just, like, hug left. But I think there's a, a star along here. Maybe not. Uh, I've already fucked up. Oh, yes. We got one. Okay, well, let's hug right, because that's sort of what we've been doing. That is how you complete mazes. I believe. I mean, there is a map that we could use. That's probably just as useful. Uh, I just don't really know which direction we are. It looks like if we go right and then left... We might get there. Well, we got some gold, so worth it. Yeah, okay, great. Yeah, it's 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 easier to follow the map, I think. Okay, if we go left, left, straight, right, we should get there. So, left, left, straight. Ignore that. And then we take this right. And this should just be a one-way little passage. It should, like, curve again. I'll be at a star. Yes! Doing pretty well at this, actually. I think then we have to go backwards and then like, take a right. Oh, no, we should have gone the other way. Okay. Uh, we're almost at another one, actually. And then that one's going to be really hard to get, but I think we can get that one really easily. Okay, now we need to look for a left. And I think we just follow this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, okay, it must have been the other little passage, I think. Hopefully. Should be a star. Uh-oh. I am lost. <laughs> uh, do you think this is the entrance? Maybe. Uh, it's possible I already got that one, I guess? Oh, there we go. So we just need the one on the very far right of the map now. Oh, it's not even a maze over there. <laughs> I've done all the hard parts. You just you just follow the follow the path the whole way. Uh, I hope it teleports us out, and I don't have to find my way out. Oh, coin linen, excellent. God, this would be kind of spooky with like music and stuff. It should be. Oh no, one more. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we do have to exit it. Uh oh. 
Can I figure that out? We'll see. Oh yeah, we just go down here and follow follow the path out. And I guess Lumos will just like turn off. There we go. I did it, Professor. Hmm. Oh, well done, excellent. Ten points to Gryffindor. The Lumos charm is now unlocked and can be used when you encounter dark areas in the world. When you're ready, you can head to your next class, Defense Against the Dark Arts with Professor Lupin. Uh, thank you. Hmm. Are you ready to head back to the classroom? Uh, yes. Huh. Yes, please. We did it! Yay, oh! That roof's actually fake. Stupefy! Flibendo! <laughs> uh, okay, is that the only quest we've got right now? I think so. Yes. But I do remember there being some side quests down here. Huh! Hello. Quidditch pitch. Owlery. Oh, what's out here? Oh, Neville. Luna first. Hmm. Oh, hi. Some people call me Looney Lovegood, but I'm actually called Luna. Hmm. Watch out for nargles and rack spurts. I can tell your head is full of them. Do you need help with anything, Luna? Hmm. I do, actually. Many of my possessions have been lost. Normally I'd suspect nargles, but apparently it's the other students that have been hiding them. That's not very nice. Hmm. Oh, it's all good fun, but I really do need them back. I can help you find them. Hmm. You're a very kind person. My mom always said things we lose have a way of coming back to us in the end, if not always in the way we expect. Hmm. Apparently my possessions have been hidden in the room of requirement. The hidden entrance is right above the library. I've found the library already. I can teleport back there. Hmm. These are the things I've lost. Two shoes, two stripy blue socks, my cork necklace. I'll come back with your things. Hmm. Okay, well let's grab Neville's quest as well. Hmm. Hmm. I've lost my Toad Trevor again. Last I saw was by the Owlery. Okay. Hmm. Well, I am actually right by the Owlery. What is out here? I can't quite figure out where we are. Training grounds. For what, Quidditch? Isn't the Owlery like a walk away? Isn't that the Owlery? Okay, that's Madam Hooch, so it is something to do with Quidditch out here. Uh, let's just have a look at the sign for the Owlery. Oh yeah, so the Owlery and Quidditch pitch is out here. We better go have a look at the Quidditch pitch. Which, like, you assume would be following a path? I'm not too worried about wandering super far away now because... Because we can just fast travel. I hope. I should be able to just, like, fast travel to, um... This is the entrance. <laughs> okay, well, well, we'll do the Quidditch pitch later. Um, Marauder's map. Hogwarts. Okay, we can go there. We do need to go to the library. Yes. That is so helpful. Okay, so she said it's above the room of requirement. Uh, above the library. It's like... Like in the movies, it's just outside a hall. But maybe if we go all the way up the staircase, maybe we'll be able to get out. Or I can just like hop onto the roof again and, and go back in, maybe. Oh, it does actually... Our quest marker does point to it. So I don't know if we're on the right level for it here. Yeah, I think this is probably a bit high. I assume it'll change to like below soon. No, she did say above above the the library. Okay, there is nothing up here though. Oh, here we go. There's a big bell up here. And another nope, no more little staircases. Okay, if we jump, it says it's below. So yeah, we gotta we gotta get out. I think I know how to do it. Oh, almost. Damn it. Wow, this this will be easier. Oh, hello. Little burbs. Okay, this is all still the library. <laughs> it's pretty big, isn't it? But our cursor's moving. And it's above. Okay, so we're, we're getting close. That's the way to Ravenclaw. Maybe if we go up this... This little staircase? We can't really. Still above. Okay, we're very close to it here. Yeah, it's gotta be, it's gotta be like right there, right? <laughs> Is it activated by this little lever? <laughs> yeah, it must be in there, right? Just wanted to have a little explore. Let's see what this lever does. Oh. The room of requirement? Yes? Oh! 
Oh, it's the lost the lost thingies thing one. Find Luna's belongings in the room for requirement. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Um What was it? There was two socks. Uh and a cork necklace. And two something or others. I bet we're gonna have to climb. Luckily it's fairly easy to climb in here. Anything sticking out. I can use C to zoom in, which is quite useful. Oh, something's glowing over there. See that purpley glowing. Oh, what's this water, though? Oh! I don't know how much magic I have. Ah! Oh, it's a trap. What's that? A shoe? Yes, okay. So her items are glowing purple. So it's probably better to just climb again. And look for sparkly, purple sparklies. No, that was a candle. Oh, purple sparklies. A sock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This room is huge. Oh, if if um we go back to the Marauders map, we can now go to all the places we visited already. Oh, apparently I never made it to Grimald Place. So what else have we seen? The Wizarding World. Okay, there's not many places. Oh no, where? You can go to the Lovegood residence. You can go to Azkaban. Oh god. Hogsmeade. We've been to the station, so we could probably find the rest of Hogsmeade pretty easily. And the secrets. We got one of them. That's pretty cool. I wonder if we can find the rest. Chamber of Secrets. I mean, we just go to one of the bathrooms. I say it like it'll be easy to find a bathroom in this place. Oh, found one of her socks. Excellent. Surprised there's not like more chests in here. Although I guess like just finding the room is is kind of like a pretty neat reward anyway. Oh, a chest. Hooray. Oh no! Jesus! <laughs> Fuck, they're so scary. I don't have any spells. I should have learned stupefy. <laughs> Damn it. It's okay, they probably can't climb very well. Uh oh. They can climb very well! Ah. <laughs> uh... Oh. Just need one of one more Luna thing. Oh, there's a phone box. A telephone box. Weird. Oh no, the books are still down there. Oh fuck, they're they're gonna try and climb up here. One of them's gonna grab me and it's gonna scare the hell out of me. Do I get anything for climbing all the way to the top? Oh my god, they're coming. <laughs> oh I hate it. Oh I have my sword! Die. Die. It's not doing anything to them. <laughs> ah! <laughs> My sword's useless. God, even with them all glowing purple, it's really hard to find them. And I think they're all, like, just on the ground floor. They're not, like, up on top or anything, because that would be even harder. Unless, like, maybe the fifth one is hidden. <laughs> Up on top of a pile somewhere. I don't think so. Oh, yes. We can almost leave. Got it. Return to Luna Lovegood. Um, can I fast travel anywhere near here? Training grounds, that's where she was. Perfect. Yes, please. There's the horrible books in here. Luna, I'm back. I have your things. Hello. Mm. I've got your belongings. Mm. Oh, you found my possessions. How extraordinarily wonderful. Here, take this. Thanks. Mm. Yay, we did it! I think the real reward was finding the room of requirement. Does she have another quest? Hmm. Is there something else I can help with? Hmm. Uh, not right now. Hmm. Okay. Perhaps Dad does. He's looking for Nargles. He wants to write about them in the Quibbler. Might be able to help. Hmm. Oh! Yeah, let's go to the Lovegood residence. Sure. Should probably just go to all these places so I have them in my map. <gasps> oh, I wish it was daytime. <laughs> we'll just let everything load. Oh, did Luna not come with me? That's the house. The Lovegood residence. Oh, Luna's here. Hello. Uh, Tonta Xenophilius Lovegood. Oh, so cool. A little like, kitchen back here. Nope. Okay, this is a nice little place to explore. Oh, that means that, like, Ron's quest will probably take us to the burrow, I'd guess. What's downstairs? Did they ever go downstairs? 
Oh. Neat. <laughs> ah, Senator Phileas Lovegood. Hello. How's it going? Hmm. Your head looks full of rack spurts. Hmm. Lena said you're looking for nargles. Hmm. Nargles? Nargles are everywhere. It's a wonder that more people don't spot them. I even think I might have seen signs of nargles over by the old windmill. Perhaps you could go there and investigate. I'd very much like to print any information you find in the quibbler. Hmm. You need to use a pair of spectre specs. I'll provide a pair of them in case you don't have some already. Thank you. Hmm. Now go to the windmill. Put on your spectre specs. Look for clues. Okay, travel to the windmill first, obviously. Let's get some spectre specs. I need to go to Diagon Alley and just sell a bunch of this shit. Spectre specs. Equip. That's probably taking the the route the the place of my <laughs> of my scarf, but I like how these look, <laughs> so I'm leaving those on all the time. Oh, yes, yeah, a wizard card. Oh, the sun's coming up. Great. Um, it's this way apparently. Ah, oh. off we go. Wow, I did not think they would like put this much effort into non-Hogwarts locations. Oh my god, is that the burrow? I, I knew they were neighbours. Fuck. We don't even need Ron to get us to the... We, we can just wander around the wizarding world. <laughs> like, I thought being able to go around London was impressive, and it is. But we, we can just, we can walk from the Lovegood residence to the burrow. <laughs> it's incredible. <laughs> Okay, they better not, none of them have, can be here. Or my immersion will be broken. Oh, the car. And I guess, like, Bill and George could be here. But Ron. What are you doing here, Ron? So Arthur's got a quest. Hmm. I bet you know all about the Muggle world. Could you do me a favor? Hmm. I'm most fascinated by the world of Muggles. Could you go to London and bring you back some of those interesting items? Letter- Ow. I can do that. What am I being attacked by? Ah! God, I really should have got a, a stupefy. Lumos! <laughs> ah, Ron! Jeez. Horrifying. Um... <laughs> Doesn't do anything, does it? Eh. Okay, Molly's here. Oh, is the clock anywhere? I think I'd be in the kitchen. Oh god, don't want to go outside. Oh my god, tiny little rooms. Oh, gold snitch! Wow. Can't believe we found that. Little bathroom in here. Oh, you can have a look out over the like corn wheat field. This this must be Ron's room. So it's got the Chudley Cannon's orange. Decorations. Is that it for the burrow? Oh no, you can go up here as well. Don't worry, there's plenty here. Oh, there's the attic, of course. That you can maybe go see. Uh, I assume this is the attic. Do you think we'll get murdered by a ghoul? Wow. <laughs> there's even more. Oh, I love the design of the burrow. Holy crap. This is great. Oh, another snitch! I'm the best at this. This is just someone's room in here. Don't think this is Ron's. Could be, I suppose. I think this is the last place we can check out. That's a very nice, nice little desk, jeez. Maybe the twins' room? I would guess. Also Chudley Cannon's yellow, uh, orange. Okay, so the windmill is over that way. We still can't even see it. Ah! Nailed it. Just hoping I don't get attacked by frogs again. Because that was terrifying. Oh, I can just see the windmill in the distance. Out of my periphery. <laughs> what if those weren't frogs that were attacking us? What if they were actually, like, rack spurts or, or nargles? And we could only see them because we're wearing our very fashionable spectre specs. <laughs> okay, I know there's nargles or something around here. God, this would be a great view if uh, my render distance was a bit higher. <laughs> I, I could probably turn it up because we're not at Hogwarts. But... Don't think I'll bother. Uh, it is equipped. So we just have to investigate. Found another snitch! I don't remember how many snitches there are to find, but... Oh, we have to report our findings already. 
I guess there's nothing here. Uh, we are going to fast travel back. Because it took a while to walk here. I am back, Mr. Lovegood. Um, I don't think anything happened. Hmm. Did you see anything? No? These Nargles are better hiding it than I thought. We'll find them one day. As for now, thank you. Please take this a gift, a token of my thanks. Hooray, money! We're doing, we're doing good for money now, actually. Like, what do we have? 562. Um, I think... Maybe we should, like, zoom off to Diagon Alley and just sell some things? Oh, you can't actually buy Quidditch supplies. 4,000 for a Firebolt. Wonder if we can actually use them. Amazing. Mm. Um, can I sell you things? No. Broomsticks are a useful way to get around Hogwarts and Hogsmeade. Granting access to some great views. Also, flying tracks scattered around if you're looking for a challenge. Great, okay. So we should definitely save up for one of those. Okay, I sold all my junk. We got up to 682. Uh, I guess if we're really desperate for money, eventually we could sell um, the, the fancy sword, which doesn't seem to do anything for me. <laughs> yes, thank you. Goodbye. Okay, we're back at Hogwarts now, and I think we definitely need to go do defense against the Dark Arts so we can learn, um, like an, I guess, a defensive spell that'll probably help us, because uh, we are being attacked by things now, <laughs> and it would be nice not to be attacked by things. Is this like the little, little room where they went for the Triwizard Tournament stuff? Please, I didn't think it would be this long. Down. Hello? Yes, it is. This is where Dumbledore came in and yelled, Did you put your name in the Goblet of Fire? He asked calmly. Sweet, more stuff. The trophy room. Oh, there's a snitch in there. No. Oh my god, it's actually like a leaderboard of your best times. So Lumos, best time, 522. So we're going to learn Stupefy, Brachium Amendo, Alohomora, Wingardium Leviosa, Bombarda Maxima. Vera Verito, Spectre Patronum, and we can learn Apparition and Flying. Amazing. Wow, I'm glad I, glad I found this little place. Oh, ooh, there's some stuff here. Nice. Quick Quits Quill. And there's some more money here. Sweet. It's worth, worth coming down here, absolutely. I have to fast travel back up, though. <laughs> All right, well, that will do for this episode of Minecraft School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Next time we will go uh, find the Defense Against Dark Arts classroom, we'll learn Stupefy, then maybe we'll go do that Neville quest, go find the Owlery, uh, probably go check out the Quidditch pitch, just see what it's like, see if we can see any of the flying stuff. Um, then I don't know, maybe we'll, we might go to Malfoy Manor with, with Malfoy just to go explore it. Uh, there's, still, there's still plenty to do. I know like the, the team said that this isn't supposed to be like a big RPG that you can sink hours into, but so far, there's plenty for me to do. Like, we've learned one spell. We learn, what, like nine altogether? Um, there's, there's, there's plenty to do. So I'll keep the series going for, for a while longer still. Thank you guys very much for watching this episode. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're enjoying the series. And I'll see you next time. Bye.